The Falcon 9 core, or first stage, B1035, is displayed horizontally and elevated 14 feet off the ground near Independence Plaza at the Johnson Space Center. This booster started its life carrying cargo to the International Space Station for SpaceX's 11th cargo resupply mission. That mission was also the first time SpaceX had reflown a Dragon spacecraft, and that was the first time a flight-proven booster had ever been used for a government mission. This booster's third endeavor was moving it here to the front lawn of the Johnson Space Center. SpaceX engineers and technicians actually followed similar procedures to what they would do for refurbishment between flights to get it ready to be here on display. It's one of only two SpaceX Falcon 9 boosters on display, and the first commercial space exhibit for the Johnson Space Center here in Houston. The core itself is about 47.7 meters tall and 30.1 meters in diameter. Its nine Merlin 1D engines help it lift payloads into space and land the core safely on the ground. Together with the second stage, it's known as the Falcon 9 version 1.2. The core is equipped with extendable landing legs that deploy as the core gets closer to the ground. As it approaches its landing target, two retro burns are performed to ease the rocket into a safe landing. This booster was part of two NASA missions. The first was a commercial resupply service to the International Space Station. This core acted as the first stage of the Falcon 9 rocket that propelled a Dragon spacecraft into orbit. This mission launched June 3rd, 2017 and was the first time a Dragon spacecraft was reused. This booster flew again December 15th, 2017, marking the first time NASA allowed a reusable rocket stage to be flown for one of its missions. SpaceX had previously reflown a booster, but for private company launches only. It was also the first time a reflown core landed at LZ-1, the landing zone at Cape Canaveral. After the second mission, the booster was retired. This marvel of modern technology is now open and included in general admissions at the Johnson Space Center in Houston, Texas.